And welcome everybody. Uh, I'm back to another video and this time I'm, I'm at a uh, different map now. This is uh, one of two maps that I recently downloaded and have been exploring um, just getting started in these areas now. And this one, I believe both of them are modeled after Brazil or South America. Um, and this one in particular is called Agropolis, I think is how it's pronounced. Um, I'm just getting started now. Done a little driving around. Um, this map is pretty large. Uh, as you can see, I'm zooming out here. Uh, there's a lot of dirt roads, a lot of uh, challenging terrain to drive around on. Um, so I'm really liking this map already. And uh, to get started, um, you see I've got some equipment here that I've purchased. Um, this is my. This is the first tractor I purchased, and I really like the uh, the forestry set up on here it's definitely going to be useful because uh, the amount of brush and trees and things that are covering the the narrow roads to get to fields um, that's almost that's pretty much necessary um, but today however the first field that I want to do work in that I just bought is pretty close so I'm gonna use this uh, fent and uh, the cedar that I purchased and head over there um, and this is a, uh, a small Hilux truck that I bought. Um, it's a mod that I found online. Um, unfortunately, uh, it's not very complete, <laughs> and there's no, uh, there's no, not much interior really. Um, so this is something I would just uh, be driving from the outside. <laughs> um, but you know, who knows? It might get updated in the future or not. But I just really like the aesthetic of it from the outside. So I have another Hilux. Um, which we will see when I get over to, uh, or no, I don't think that's a Hilux actually, I forget what that is. It's a definitely, it's a Toyota pickup truck, um, but I'll, yeah, I'll remember what it is when we get over there, but right now I'm going to hop in this vent, uh, hook up the cedar. Oh, I do need seed, by the way, I need, right, forget about that, and, uh, yeah, I'll be planting my first field, uh, today on this map. There it is, 55, um, so I can actually take the road. The road actually goes all that way out instead of driving all the back roads, but um, I did get soil analysis done, and of course, um, it's low in nitrogen, so that's why I've got the fertilizer uh, spreader here. It's one of my favorite machines because it can do liquid and also solid fertilizer, so this is really nice, and it's small and compact, um, which would be great for this map with all the uh, narrow jungle rainforest roads. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to get some seed real quick and get started. I'm going to see how far one bag gets us for now. Check the help menu. Uh, make sure there's any extra buttons I need to press for a manual hookup, which doesn't look like there is. the refill option. And now, let's see. Okay. Oh, well. Uh, wow, that's going to hold quite a lot. Okay, maybe I'll do purchase one more bag just so I don't have to make a bunch of extra trips. Oh, no. <laughs> now it's over there. Alright. I'm going to make sure I 
change the seed before I forget. Which this map has a lot of different, uh, a lot of different crops. Millet is a new one to me. Rice, black bean. Oh, black bean. So yeah, quite a few different ones um, to choose from. So that's exciting. I'm gonna start with canola. Uh, it's one of my favorites, but I'll, you know, I'll be exploring more crops later on. Got a lot of different fields on this map. Um, over 50, right? Check the numbering on those. Wow. Yeah, I mean, that's... <laughs> yeah, that is quite a lot of fields. Damn. Yeah, wow, that's a lot of fields. This gets up in the 70s if it's really... 80s, wow. If that really is... If it really does go all the way from 1 to 80, that is pretty pretty wild. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, so I'll be spending... I think I'm going to be spending a lot of time on this map. <laughs> Hazards on, ready for road travel. Planners folded up. Nice compact cedar. Okay. Better on some kind of construction here. Very, very bumpy roads. Access pull up spot right here. Nice. Okay. Officially in my first field about the plant. And this was yeah, initially owed. Oh yeah, there's my other truck. And yeah, I know this says needs plowing, but I prefer no-till planting. Um, so we'll just start off with that. Oh, this oh okay, this is considered a Land Cruiser. So glad I didn't keep calling it a Hilux. I'm new to you know learning about all these older Toyota trucks. This one's pretty nice. Um, it's actually got full interior. You know, like they spent a lot of time doing it. Good job designing this. Um, it definitely looks like it's set up for this map with the snorkel and uh, all the gear. So yeah, definitely excited. But <laughs> put some miles on this truck, or kilometers rather. But yeah, I'm gonna see. I need to figure out how I want to plant this. Um, I guess I could just follow the original lines. See if I can get GPS funding that time. I don't know where the, his voice is coming out of nowhere. It's nice looking planter. Pretty happy with the purchase already. Really nice looking planter. Uh, so I need to 
to figure out what I'm going to do here. I guess just back and forth. Uh, the GPS would be nice just to keep me. Lined up. Okay, one second here as I get my get my uh, stuff turned on. GPS menu on. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay, right. I don't know how to do this. I don't remember how to do it. Because, yeah, instead of following the same lines, good practice would be to, you know, change it up a little bit, in my opinion. Okay, so, hey, yeah, all, yeah, steering, steering's already on. So I just need to set cruise control here. Make sure it's still on that. tweaking still. There we go. Okay. Now that's correct. Now we're planting canola. <laughs> Steering will take over for me. I'm gonna alternate rows here. Ah, it's still pretty tight. <laughs> I'm glad 
I can see my lines because some maps the uh, lines aren't drawn correctly. and see okay <clears throat> yeah of course I'll be doing them I'll be finishing the border yeah I definitely love the jungle <laughs> the rainforest vegetation that like yeah I love it Initially, so initially I got interested in looking for this type of map because I was watching videos of uh, Africa, actually, um, videos of people like living in the Congo and things and driving down these really beat up roads and I uh, started looking for maps like that and then uh, Brazil popped up and I was like, oh, okay, let's give that a try and it's like, yeah, this is exactly what I'm looking for. So I like, yeah, definitely enjoy the appearance of the map. Next time I do this field, I'll just go straight up and down <laughs> uh, perpendicular to the lines I'm making. That would have probably been easier. I don't know what the voices are. It must be coming from a vehicle or something.
<laughs> uh, <laughs> no idea how they were planning this. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to start. I'll just start in one corner and, and plant the edge and come back for the gaps. Actually, I need to fill in the gaps first because I want to do the border last. Luckily, this will be easy because I can actually see where I've been.
Do I not have the... Oh god. Oh no, I forgot. Oh dear. <laughs> Damn. Wow, somehow I missed that the cedar wasn't one, so... Oh, I'm gonna have to redo these couple lines. Damn. Okay. Alright. Well, we're almost done. Yeah, look, I'm... Damn. Wow, that's embarrassing. <laughs> Cedar wasn't one. Idiot. Okay. Well, I'll just finish this couple lines. And... Yeah. Alright. Well, I'm going to take a break. I'm just... For fun, I'm just going to drive around some of the map real quick. Just to show how uh, neat this map is. I love all the back roads. Sweet. Yeah, sounds of the jungle as well, just been driving along. Really enjoying this map. The sound thing uh, sounds pretty sweet too when it, uh, it's just driving. I'm literally just going to drive around. <laughs> Maybe look for another cool looking field. Plus, I don't know what these things are. I guess they're bus shelters or something. Probably what they are. But I haven't seen a bus on these roads yet. And that would probably be a very uncomfortable ride.
spot. Just waiting out until I have to uh, <coughs> take a combine on these roads or something. <laughs> Yikes. This is sorghum. Interesting. That's the train tracks. <laughs>
All right, well, I think I'll park it, <laughs> park it here or end the video. And uh, just doing some exploring. There's a lot more to see on this map. Um, but yeah, farming uh, just got started, obviously, and uh, already making mistakes. But yeah, call that good for this video, and I'll see you in the next one, and thanks for watching.